ಅಖಂಡಮಂಡಲಾಕಾರ ವ್ಯಾಚರ ತತ್ಪದ ದರ್ಶಿ ತಸ್ಮ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರವೇ ನಮಃ ಅಜ್ಞಾನತಿ ಮೀರಾಂಧ್ಯ ಜ್ಞಾನಾಂಜನ ಶಲಾಕಯ ಚಕ್ಷುರುನ್ ಮೀಲಿತಂ ತಸ್ಮ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರವೇ ನಮಃ ತಸ್ಮ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರವೇ ನಮಃ ಸೊ ನವ ಶುಷ್ಕ್ಯಾಯಚ ಹರಿತ್ಯಾಯ So he is also in the Shushkyayat. He is in the dry wood as well as in the green things. Shushkyayat, Haritjayat, Namholopyayat, Ulhapyayat. He is in hard places, rocks and this dry hard, that dried out mud where nothing can grow. And then he is also in marshy tracks. Like what kind of marshy tracks? Like Everglades. This is Everglades, marshy lands. So Lord Shiva is in marshy lands. Lopya is a dry lands, Ulopya is a marshy tract. So that marshy tract is Everglades. This is Everglades. Urpya is a Surmya is a... So Lakshiva is in Urvi. Urvi means planet, earth, earth, planet, nature. So he is also in planet earth and also in the waves of the ocean. Urpya is a Surmya is a... Parnya is a Parna Sadhya is a... He is in the leaves. and the heaps of dry leaves parna sadhya is the green leaves and the dry woods parna is a parna sadhya is a and the heaps of leaves dry leaves green leaves heaps of leaves is everywhere parna is a parna sadhya is a and lot of is associated with leaf in so many places harikesha byo is described as one with a green hair or throughout the rudram you see all this color through the descriptions of lot shiva so everything is all this manifestation that's why the bilva leaf is so auspicious for lord shiva all that he need to do is just offer one bilva leaf that's all he needs one bilva leaf trijanma papa samhara tridalam trigunakaram trinetran chatriyayutam trijanma papa samharam eka bilvam shivarpanam dishruti so and if you offer one leaf that's all of karma again this karma what is done ತ್ರಿಜನ್ಮ ಪಾಪ ಸಂಹಾರ ಸೊ ಪರ್ಣಾಯಚ ಪರ್ಣ ಸಧ್ಯಾಯಚ ಅಪಗುರಮಾನ ಒನ್ ಹೂ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಇಸ್ ವೆಪನ್ಸ್ ರೈಸ್ಡ್ ಅಪ್ ರೆಡಿ ಟು ಸ್ಟ್ರೈಕ್ ದ ವೆಪನ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಇನ್ ಇಸ್ ಇನ್ ಇಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾಬಾರ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಶಿಲ್ಡರ್ ಆರ್ ಎನಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ರೆಡಿ ಇಸ್ ಗೋಲ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಇಸ್ ರೈಸ್ಡ್ ವೆಪನ್ಸ್ ರೈಸ್ ರುದ್ರ ಗಣ ಸೊ ಎಲ್ ದರ್ ವೆಪನ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಲಿಫ್ಟ್ ರೆಡಿ ಟು ಸ್ಟ್ರೈಕ್ ಏದರ್ ಯುವರ್ ಎನಿಮೀಸ್ ಹಿ ಟು ಪ್ರೊಟೆಕ್ಟ್ ದ ಬಕ್ತಸ್ or even to hurt you if you have done some bad thing so he is always ready there with his weapons ready abhigna pechanama and then he is always right in the front abhigna pechanama with his weapons ready up namopagramanaya cha abhigna pechanama akhidate cha prakhidate cha namo who can afflict slightly and also grievously depending upon the karma palas either you can afflict you slightly with slight affliction minor inconvenience or you could be grievous depending upon what kind of karma you created so namaki dete cha prakhi dete cha namam vakki rike yo but it's never more or less exactly as per your karma so exactly as per your karma there the more or less that the results are given so he such a just dispenser of justice ಆಕಿದೇ ಚ ಪ್ರಕಿದೇ ಚ ನಮೋ ಬಕೀರ್ಕೇಭ್ಯೋ ದೇವಾನಾಗಂ ಹೃದಯೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ವಿಕ್ಷೀನಕೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ವಿಚಿಂಧತ್ಕೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ನಿರ್ಹೃದೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮ ಆಮಿ ವತ್ಕೇಭ್ಯ ಇ ಡ್ವಲ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಹಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಗಾಡ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಯು ಶವರ್ಸ್ ವರ್ಲ್ ದಿಸ್ ಆರ್ ದ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಫೋರ್ ವರ್ಸಸ್ ಶವರ್ಸ್ ವರ್ ನಾಟ್ ಲೈಬಲ್ ಟು ಚೇಂಜ್ ಯು ವಿಲ್ ಸೀ ದಮ್ ಇವೆಂಚುವಲ್ ಡಬ್ಲ್ಯೂ ಡಿ ಎಚ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಹೂ ಡ್ವಲ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಹಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಗಾಡ್ಸ್ So, the WDHG, when you do Rudra Homam, 
This particular part is always split. Namo Bhakti Rigebhyo Devanakam Rudebhyo Namaswaha Am Namo Vichy Nagebhyo Devanakam Rudebhyo Namaswaha Am Namo Vichy Nagebhyo Devanakam Rudebhyo Namaswaha Namo Anir Hatebhyo Devanakam Rudebhyo Namaswaha Am Namo Ami Bhatke Bhyo Devan Yung Dude Bhyo Namaswaha Am But when you chant Uttaram, this is only once it comes there. The same way when you do intent Tanuakam. Teshagam Sahasri Yodhi Nevalan Vani Tanmas. But Kirike Bhyo, who showers well. And Kirikaha also means who can destroy at will. At will means as per the karma for data. So if he wants to do it, he can do it. So nobody can stop him. Destroy it will no more with Kiri Kebi and he wants to destroy and also wants to wants to create, wants to give you the best he can do it and he can also do the opposite. Deva Nagam to the Bhyonamo Vikshina Ke Bhyonamo. So it's not liable to decay. This is uh beautiful statue place is Mradesha. So anybody who goes to South Karnataka like Mangalore, that area would be don't miss this one. This is Murdeshwar. So, not liable to decay. Vikshina Kebhyo Devanagam Hridayebhyo Namaha. He's not liable to decay. And again, another meaning is that he can also bring about decay. Bring about decay means he can, he can destroy. He can chinam kurvanti vikshina ha. Vikshina Kebhyo. Chinam kurvanti. That was also like in the previous verse. There are two meanings to it. Same way, he can destroy also, he can give you wealth. So same way, he is, he is not non-destructible, but he himself can destroy in various ways. Vikshina, Vikshinam Kruvanti, Vikshina, Kebhyo, Devanagam, Devyo, Ramad, Vichinvat, Kebhyo, Devanagam, Devyo, Ramad, who search and examine the good and the bad in each one. He just doesn't punish, or punish just like outright overboard, he examines both the good and the bad, you know, like he go in front of a judge and he say, oh, this man is a good man, he just this one thing which is bad. So the, all these things are taken into account. So Shiva does the same thing, he takes into account both the good and the bad and dispenses justice. So Nigraha Anugraha, he does both, 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 he does both Anugraha as well as Nigraha. And then Vichinvat Kev Yonama, he reaches the good to bless and catches the wrong to punish. That is Vichinmat Kebhya. Anir Hatebhya. Definitely bring affliction for Papa Karma. There is no two ways about it. They definitely bring affliction for Papa Karma. Anir Hatebhya. Who have rooted out sin utterly. That's another meaning. Anir Hatebhya. There is, there is absolute purity. Lord Shiva is absolute purity. So when we describe in our Panchamukha Puja, when the west face of Lord Shiva, uh, we say this mantra, Rudra Marudgana Architapatam Rigvedana Dodayam Vandeham Sakalam Kalankarahitam Stanur Mukham Pashimam Kalankarahitam That's what Anir Hatha, which means it's completely rooted out, blemishes. So that is Anir Hatha, Vandeham Sakalam Kalankarahitam Stanormukam Pakshimam. That is that's the west face of Lord Shiva. Now, the last word, like I said, this is the last last edges. Ami Vakya Deva Nagam Hradeyonamah. Assume the grass form and stand in the material shape of the universe. That's what that means. So remember when we started in Anuakam to Namo Hiranya Bahave. So Hiranya Bahave means we, we started with Hiranya Garbha, which is the source of creation. Now here at the end of the 300 verse, 300 verse, the Rudra Trishadi, at the end of Anuakam 9, the Rishi brings us to a glorious conclusion saying that you are this whole universe. Starting from the Hiranya Garbha, he takes us through like this whole panorama of creation. The frog, the, the dog, the owner of the dog, the, the ant, the pebble, the lightning. So the entire, entire panoramic creation and brings it to a glorious conclusion right here as that he being the entire universe. By the way, this is a picture of the universe that was created by Wilkinson Microwave Anisotropy Probe. It's called WMAP. You can Google it. How does it look like?
Doesn't it look like a Shiva Lingam? We worship the cosmic God, Lord Shiva, who is in the form of universe in Shiva Lingam. This is Shiva Lingam. And this is being validated by latest in science. So this is the first uh, attempt to picture the universe, and that's what the universe came up to look like. And then they went further, sent a more sensitive satellite with instruments on it, and that was uh, called Planck's satellite, the Planck's instrument. And the Planck even brought much beautiful pictures of the uh, universe as a shivalinga, with more details, with the Swarna Rekha of the shivalinga. Does anybody, anybody know, does anybody remember that where there is the Shivalingam with the Swarna Rekha, which naturally manifested, does anyone? You can unmute your microphone and talk to me. Does anyone know where there is a real Shivalingam with the Swarna Rekha? There is. In Pokambike temple in Kollur. This is what was revealed to Adi Shankaracharya in Kollur Mukambika. There is the Shivalingam with the Swarna Rekha. And the Yale Raja brought that out when he made that movie, Thai Mukambike brought that information out to the world. So, what is this uh, Planck's satellite has given us? A Shivalingam with the Swarna Rekha, right? Lord Shiva, creation. So, Shakti manifested as Shivalingam because it's Shiva Shakti manifested with the Swarna Rekha. So, it took one year for that Planck satellite to do this. Our rishis didn't send a Planck satellite. Our rishis didn't send a Hubble telescope. Our rishis just closed the eyes and said, Om Shiva, 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 Shiva. Yoga Swami was a great saint in uh, Sri Lanka. He says, Anda charachara mellam Shiva, Shiva, yen akhatinullay kandu kondi en Shiva, Shiva. No telescope needed, no Hubble needed, no Planck satellite needed. Just close your eyes. Shiva, 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 Shiva. He says, within that two letters are found everything. So everywhere, whether it's Tamil or whether it is of grace in 100 years ago, 50 years ago, or 5,000 years ago, like Tirumolar, Shiva, Shiva, Yengala, Thivina, Yala, Shiva, Shiva, Yendra, Thivina, Malam, Shiva, Shiva, Yendra, Devaru, Mava, Shiva, Shiva, Yendra, Shiva, Gadi, 5,000 years ago, same, about 1,000 years ago, 100 years ago, Arut Perinjodi, Tanik Parangarunai, Chidambara Pate, Thirupattu, Alladhar Pate, Allah, Thirupattu, Ramana Maharishi, hmm? everything, Haruna Chala Shiva, Haruna Chala Shiva. Our rishis didn't send a Planck satellite, our rishis didn't send a Hubble telescope, our rishis just closed the eyes and said, Om Shiva, 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 Shiva. So just put it in there to just to give you a depth of what we have in Hinduism, to validate all these things. Finally, Ami, Ami Vatkebhyaha, so the same word. Uh, that is the last word. It also means that not only he is this universe with the Swarna Rekha, but he's also, he is the one who is a Karma Paladatta, who alternately brings about happiness and suffering, depending upon your karmas. And Ami Vatkebhyaha not only means he is this universe, but he is also the Karma Paladatta. And the third meaning of Ami Vatkebhyaha is uh, for the devotees of Lord Shiva, wherever they are visible or invisible. So that is how it ends. So the Ami Vat, Nama Ami Vatkebhyaha Deva Nagam Hridayabhyo Nama. So the devotees are glorified here, finally. So not only Shiva is this universe, but the Ami Vatkebhyaha means the three most three aspects of Lord Shiva, Ami Vatyabhya means that he has this universe in Ashta, in, in Ashta Murti, but in eight forms he is this universe. And then he is a Karma Paladata who brings happiness and suffering alternately, but ultimately he is in the form of his devotees. Yeraivaro thundar ulla thudukkum thundar dambarumai sollamum arithe. So, but then Lord Shiva lives in the heart of devotees, therefore the most glorious thing, the most biggest thing is the devotee himself.